consider g of x equal x cubed and a is 0. This means that we let the values of our x approach 0. Let's use a table of values and let's see first the behavior of the function as x approaches 0 from the left or from values that are less than 0. If you observe in the table as x approaches 0 from the left, the function values stay negative, but they are getting closer and closer to zero. So we say that the left-hand limit or the limit of g of x as x approaches zero from the left is zero. On the other side, when we take values of x that are greater than zero, we see that the values of x stay positive, but they decrease to zero or they are getting closer and closer to zero. So we say that the limit of g of x as x approaches 0 from the right is 0. So this is an example where function values, the left function value and the right hand function values are opposite signs, but their limits are equal. So since the left hand and the right hand limits exist and are equal to 0, we say that the limit of the function as x approaches 0 is 0. We can see this visually by sketching the graph of the function. So this is the graph of x cubed. And let's move points from the left of 0 and let x get closer and closer to 0. So as x gets closer and closer to 0, the point on the graph moves closer to the origin. Or g approaches 0. So this means that the limit of g of x as x approaches 0 from the left is 0. So this confirms the left-hand limit that we've shown earlier. On the right-hand side, as we, move the as we move x to 0, the points on the graph are also getting closer and closer to the origin. This means that g is getting closer and closer to 0. So we have the right-hand limit which is the limit of g of x as x approaches 0 from the right is equal to 0. So again, the left hand and the right hand limits are equal. So therefore, the limit of x as x the limit of g as x approaches 0 is 0. So we want to emphasize at this point that the limit is not the function value. There may be cases when the function value is equal to the limit of the function, but we could not assume that it's true for all cases.